TFNN. Headline News Update. Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in Clearwater, Florida. It's 1 p.m. Eastern time, three hours until that closing bell. Let's check in on the markets as all major indices are in the green. Looking at NASDAQ up 17 points, trading at 67.81. Dow Jones up 22 points, trading at 23,561. And S&P's positive by about three points, trading at 2590. Let's jump over to the Nadex platform, check in on some of the futures markets, start things off with the S&P 500 December contract. At basically the intraday highs, currently trading 2587, quite an uptrend we've had for the day. NASDAQ 100, somewhat similar, not quite at the highs, but 6306.57 on the NASDAQ 100. Gold, quite a run in some of these commodities. We'll jump around. Gold currently trading 1282, almost got up to 1284, was trading down to about 1271 just as of the market open, about 930. So quite a little $10, $12 run in the price of gold, December contract. We'll see where that finishes out for the day. Jumping around to another commodity, natural gas, quite an uptrend as well. Was trading about 305, 306, call it this morning, up five, six pennies. 311.64 currently on that natural gas December contract and crude. Check that out. Crude trading above $57 for the first time in a while was down just at 9.30, 55.65, and quite a run, almost a buck fifty in the price of oil. Crude oil December contract in that two and a half hour period currently trading 57.08, and maybe that has something to do with, of course, Saudi Arabia. Corruption crackdown, power grab, whatever you want to call it, some turmoil going on in the Middle East today, yesterday, and market reacting with the higher price of crude oil. What else we have going on in there? Fundamentally, take a look at the VIX first. VIX 948, not too much action there at all. We had Sprint and T-Mobile, their deal falling apart and Sprint falling apart with it, down over 10% for the day, currently trading at 597 Broadcom trying to take over Qualcomm, and I think the price there was about $70. So the market seeing some appreciation from Friday, about $54, call it, up to $65 for the market open, pulling back a bit. $62.41, still quite a day for Qualcomm. And lastly, as we wrap things up, some of the winners and losers of that T-Mobile deal, Verizon down 4% as competition might heat up, and Charter, get it up there. Charter Communications up for us. Stay tuned. Steve Rose, Dave White, and Tom O'Brien this afternoon. I'll talk to you next hour. Deep and end up.